hey everyone and welcome back to my channel and if you're new what up do i need to say anything it happened again but there's not a lot in my defense there's not a lot I originally went in to do a return so your girl could get the new bake shop items because I told y'all I didn't like the almond vanilla body wash and then I ended up buying some things that I didn't really want, didn't really like. So I returned some things and I ended up getting the bake shop collection. So that is included in this haul. And then while I was in there, I just happened to see some little tidbits here and there. So I had to grab them because they were 75% off. So let's get right into the haul. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I got a bunch of wallflowers because they were on sale for $187. And I was like, you know what? We are about to start going into spring and I definitely want some spring scents. So I got a bunch of wallflowers for $187, which I thought was a really good deal. I got two of the watermelon lemonade wallflowers because watermelon lemonade is just a classic scent that I love so much. I got two of the Mango Mai Tai. Mango Mai Tai is also a really nice springtime, summertime scent. It's mango nectar, jasmine flower, and sun-kissed grapefruit. It'll make your house, your room, your bathroom smell amazingly fruity. Um, then I got Market Peach. I know that they brought this out as a candle, so I kind of just wanted to try this scent out. This is Juicy Peaches, Dew Covered Leaves, and Hint of Vanilla. I'm hoping that it doesn't smell like all of their other peach scents that they have like peach bellini and whatever other peach scents that they have y'all know which ones i'm talking about then i got two pineapple mangoes because pineapple mango is so juicy and fruity and sweet i actually have the candle in this oh my god it is so good so imagine having those in your wall and then burning the pineapple mango candle perfection and then the last one I got is Waikiki Beach Coconut because Waikiki Beach Coconut is a classic in both body care and home fragrance. So, yeah. Y'all, those were amazing deals. Like, $187 for some wallflowers. Come on now. Uh, so, 75% off body care. I had to get me a Pearberry body care set because I love Pearberry during the spring and summertime. I've gone through a couple of sets of these over the years because it's just so fruity and berry and sweet it smells amazingly good in the shower gel it's like super sweet and the body cream and spray is just as good i just really like this as a fresh getting out of the shower kind of not going to be doing too much during the day just laying around the house type of scent it is really good i got another ice pear margarita shower gel because this is beautiful in the shower another one that's just crazy super sweet has a little bit of lemon to it. Ugh, smells so good. Love this one. I also got a lemon drop martini shower gel. I told you guys in my last haul that they had canceled my shower gel. So I was only able to get the spray. But again, lemon drop martini is a good one for in the shower. It definitely smells like a sweet. It honestly smells like a sweet lemon cake. And I guess that's because it has lemon zest sugar cane and then sweet cream to me it does not smell like an alcoholic drink there is no alcohol in this scent whatsoever it kind of smells like lemon pound cake to me and so i wanted to get it in the shower gel the spray to me is just okay i feel like the spray has a little bit more of an alcoholic scent to it but when i smelled the shower gel i was just like oh yeah you're coming home with me because the shower gel is a lot sweeter then i ended up getting two twinkling nights body lotions I got this based off of Living Ash's recommendation. She said that Twinkling Nights is so good. I also got it because of La Monet here on YouTube. I love her videos. I love her comments. Every time she comments, she always has some bomb recommendations. So she said that Twinkling Nights was good as well and I could trust both of them. So I picked up two body lotions. Swear y'all, I didn't even smell it in store. Didn't even smell it. I just immediately grabbed it when I saw it. There were only three body lotions left and I was just like, yep, give me two. I'll leave one for somebody else but this is frosted jasmine petals whip vanilla and mandarin blossom just off the scent notes I felt like I would like this because it has jasmine it has vanilla and then it has a little bit of a floral note to it to me this is heavy on the jasmine and the vanilla it's kind of a generic type of scent but a still really good one I wish I did have the spray to go with this as well but I compared this with a nice perfume and I feel like it'll be really good so I'm glad I picked up two of those 
then I finally got the strawberry pound cake shower gels because when I was on my way to the store, I was going to pick up two of the shower gels from the new bake shop collection because you guys know they brought strawberry pound cake out back with this collect. Did I say that right? They brought this back out with the new collection. So I was going to pick up two shower gels from that collection, but I would have had to pay full price. And the full price, y'all know, is $13.50. I was not about that life. So I was happy that they had strawberry pound cake 75% off. Oh my God. I had the lotion, the body spray, the hand cream, the hand sanitizer, the candle, the wallflower. The only thing I was missing was the shower gel. Oh my God, you guys, I was so happy. Oh my God, I was so happy to get this in the shower gel. This smells amazing. Oh, it is so crazy, super sweet in the shower gel. To me, this smells like what the candle smells like. In the candle, you get that super heavy whipped cream note and then the golden shortcake. And then it smells like strawberries. It basically smells like whipped cream and strawberry cake. It is so super gourmand and I am so happy that I was able to grab two. Once again, they only had three of these left. I grabbed two, saved one for somebody else. I try not to be too greedy, but y'all know how that is. Okay, and then I got a Blooming Garden Fine Fragrance Mist. I've also heard Living Ash talk about this and I had to grab it. This is beautiful. The first couple times I skipped over it because I was just like, yeah, it's just a generic floral scent. Like it just smells like florals, but this is actually, a really nice fresh floral scent like it's a lot more fresh but still floral at the same time yes this is just a really bright fresh type of floral clean fresh out of the shower type of scent okay 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 so on to the bake shop collection oh wait wait i have one more item to show you guys that was 75 percent off this is the true blue spa mango moisturizing body butter at first this was 50 percent off and then they took it down to 75 percent off so your girl had to like backtrack um let me get that for 75 percent off i really wanted this because of the smell everyone always talks about the smell of this Oh, and it does smell so good. This smells like a fruity mango drink. Like something you would get when you're on a vacation at a resort. That is what this smells like. So I wanted this in my collection. It doesn't have any scent notes in it, I don't think. I think it just says body butter with mango butter. Yep, that is it, that is all. So now, here's my bake shop collection items. Now, I only got two scents, you guys, because I'll let you guys know in my first impression slash review of this collection, I did not want the chocolate covered cherries because that was just not my vibe. It, it was not my vibe. And again, if I'm paying full price for something, I wanna get things that I like, so chocolate covered cherries was not on my list i did not like it and then i didn't want to get strawberry pound cake because i already have it and again i would have had to pay full price for these items i did not pay anything because like i said i did a return so i was able to get coconut cream pie i really like this in store but i'm gonna let you guys know a little bit more fully in detail how i feel about this scent so yeah coconut cream pie is toasted coconut flakes caramel custard and golden pie crust you guys this packaging is stunning so pretty love how they're doing the colored caps and just look at the sweet treats on the front of the package i know some people are gonna say that this is so juvenile it looks like a kid's collection but if y'all know me y'all know i'm very much into cute girly shiny blingy anything cute I'm very much so into it. So I love the packaging. I think it is absolutely gorgeous. And then I also got raspberry jam donut. Now my store did not have raspberry jam donut lotion, which I might have to double back and go and get her because this is good. So raspberry jam donut is wild raspberry jam, powdered sugar, and warm fluffy donut. Again, packaging so cute. Love the color top. Love the color of the shower gel and of the spray actually. The spray actually has that kind of pinky raspberry type of coloring to it, which I think just 
goes with the whole aesthetic of the collection this is really cute you guys oh my god i'm definitely about to film a video on like i said my first impressions and reviews of this collection but i just first wanted to get my little haul out of the way you guys know this in my annual sale will be over on monday i believe at 6 a.m so you guys need to take advantage of this stuff now this weekend run to your stores see what all they have for 75 percent off get all that you can because it's about to be over so yes that's everything that i got with this haul i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did you already know go ahead and give it a big thumbs up leave me a comment down below letting me know that you enjoyed it if you are new definitely go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as the bell notification so that you can be notified every single time that i upload a video and i'll see you guys in my next one peace